Welcome to Trumbull Industries' new series of installation animations. This one is our valve position indicator for a buried service valve with a one-piece square extension stem with field cutting and calibration instructions. With both valve and valve position indicator in the fully closed position, install the one and a quarter inch square extension stem onto the two inch operating nut of the valve. Place the cast iron housing adapter over the extension stem and into the valve box top section. Then, making sure that the top of the housing adapter is flush with the final grade, use a straight edge to mark the final grade line on the extension stem. Next, remove the housing adapter and the now marked extension stem Measure two and three quarter inch below the grade line and mark. This new mark is your cut line. Cut the extension stem at the cut line and deburr any sharp edges. Place the cut to length extension stem back into the valve box, making sure that it is properly mounted on the operating nut of the valve. Then place the cast iron housing over the extension stem and into the valve box top section. Slide the valve position indicator onto the square extension stem, making sure that its two flats are captured between the two matching shoulder flats in the housing adapter. This prevents the position indicator base from rotating while operating the valve. Place the two inch operating nut onto the extension stem and tighten the set screw. To calibrate the position indicator, First, fully open the valve. Note the red indicator arrow now points to the number of turns required to open this valve. Next, loosen the three screws and rotate the open mark on the indicator plate until it aligns with the red indicator arrow and tighten the three set screws. Now, fully close the valve. The red indicator arrow should now align with the closed mark on the indicator. If it does, you have correctly calibrated your valve and valve position indicator assembly. To complete the installation, install the optional Trumbull Debris Shield designed to keep dirt and debris out of the valve box and to keep the indicator legible. Then finally, place the valve box lid in the cast iron housing adapter. Congratulations! Your valve position indicator assembly is now ready to operate. Your operators will now be able to accurately determine the position of this valve at all times.